let's talk about the distributive property. The distributive property is a fun first step in learning some algebra equations, learning how to solve algebra equations. So when we see this, we'll multiply the 10 by the 1. And we'll multiply the 10 by the 2x, and we'll get 10 plus 20x. So the word distributive comes from distributing this 10 to each number or variable in the expression, right? So each term in the expression. So that will be 10 plus 20x. 10 plus 20x. Okay, and we can also do the same thing from the right. So we can distribute from the right. We can say, I'm going to put the 9 in here, and I'm going to put the 9 in here. 9 times 9x will be 81x. 9 times 6 will be 54. So we'll have 81x plus 54. And they've tried to trick you with every single combination that looks like that, but the top left one is 81x plus 54. Okay, again, we'll distribute from the right, and we'll get 8 times 10 plus 10 times 10, or 10x times 10, right? And that's going to be 80 plus 100x. So 80 plus 100x. That's this. Okay, now we're coming in from the left. So it's nice to change it up. So we'll get 28x plus 28. Again, from the left, so we'll have 3 times 4 and 3 times 3x, so that'll be 12 plus 9x. Twelve plus nine x. How about this? Nine x times five, three times five. So what's nine times five? It's forty five. Don't forget the x plus fifteen. Forty five x plus fifteen. Thank you. Okay, how about this? 3x times 7, 8 times 7. So that's going to give us 21x plus 8 times 7 is 56. So we have 21x plus 56. Algebra is all about a lot of practice. So just try to have fun. I know it's hard, but just try to enjoy it a little bit. A little bit more each day. 21x plus 56. Two times five, five x times five. So this will be 10 plus 25 x. 5 times 2 is 10, 5 times 5 is 25, and now there's that little x there, we can't forget it. So 10 plus 25x, that is this one. Better circle it or I'll forget it when I close the scratch pad. Okay, how about this? 8 times 1 and 8 times 3x, so that'll be 8 plus 24x. So that's going to be that, 8 plus 24x. And 
Last one. Eight times five. Eh, we might take a peek at the, the next. Oh, there's only one level here. That makes sense. Five times eight is 40. Eight times six is 48. So we have 48x. That's going to be this. 40 plus 48x, so we'll hit it, and we will say, perfect. We are awesome math gamers, and we will continue practicing with the skill recommendation below. So, you guys do that, and I'll see you next time.